Okay, a block of mass 4 kg rests on a rough horizontal table and a force of 6 Newton acts on the block at an angle of 30 degrees to horizontal in downward direction. The block is at the point of slipping. I think this one also we have done. So, again, let's say block, block, let's give it a rough rectangular shape. This is the rough horizontal surface. Then, uh, so what is that? The forces on this, forces, downward forces how much? 4G should be downward force. And the force of 6 Newtons acts on the block at an angle 30 degrees to horizontal in downward direction. In downward direction means from here, we need to take here in downward direction. The angle here is 30 degrees. Okay. Uh, the block is at the point of slipping. Find the value of coefficient of friction. Once again, we have to take all the forces. So we have upward force. What is this? This is the reaction. Then because the force is pushing it right side, friction will act on the left side, right? And this is mu times r, correct? Yes. So start solving now. So which one you want to take again? Shall we start with vertical again? So this force is value is given now six newtons. Yes. Okay. So sigma y again. So this is our y axis, and this is our x axis, right? So sigma y, all the forces in y direction, r is upwards minus four g, and the component of this will also act downward, right? So yes. 6 into sin a cos vertical component. Sin a cos. For this on the vertical component will be sin. Sin. Because it's going away, you have to take sin. So sin of 30. Positive or negative? Uh, to be Negative. Negative. So R and that and that. So all the vertical components taken. So sum should be equal to zero. Of R is the only unknown here. Find it. So R is four G plus six into sine thirty. Sine thirty is one by two. So that is three. So four G plus three. What do we get? Thirty-two point two four. Yes. Newtons. So now we know the value of R. Next, we have to take sigma x. What are the components in x direction? Six newtons. What is the horizontal component? Six into cos your sign. The horizontal component is six into sines. Sorry. The cos. Cos. Because this is adjacent now. Adjacent yes. means we will get cos. So 6 cos 30 and it is acting in which direction? It's acting in forward direction. So this is to be positive. Correct? Yes. And this is acting left side. So minus mu r. These are the only two horizontal components. Total should be 0. Now here r value we know. So substitute we will get mu as 6 cos 30 divided by r. What do we get? 60. How much? Got it? Yes. Yes. Zero point one two three. Yes. 